the facts, the truth, may not be as exciting as a false narrative. Mboya wanted to kill Kenyatta, Kenyatta killed him first. That's very exciting, but it is not the truth. Indeed, it is very clear, it is very obvious, for anybody who wants to study this subject in Kenyan history, that the assassination of Mboya was part of a larger operation that started with the assassination of yet another Kenyan, Arguing Skodek, in January 1969, was followed by Mboya's assassination and ended with the Kisumo massacre. Those three events in Kenyan political history are linked.